place that Kenny Chesney just described, I'm proud as anyone to say, that's where I come from. Back where I come from, you enjoy the simple things in life. Back where I come from, you always remember the place that you call home. Back where I come from, you don't ever forget the people who helped get you where you are today. See where I come from? Hayfields surround the white stucco house that I grew up in. On the west side of the property, rows and rows of golden willows border those hayfields. And way off in the distance, Laramie Peak towers the horizon. This is the place that holds my fondest childhood memories. Back where I come from, these are the memories that you cherish forever, as they serve as a constant reminder of where you come from, how you got where you are today, and who's helped you along the way. One of my greatest childhood memories of growing up is from our place in Wheatland. You see, at the age of nine, my younger brother Landon and I would ride the bus home every afternoon after school. Now, before that vehicle could get to a stop, he and I were racing down the aisles. We'd jump off the bus, and then we'd sprint down the driveway. We'd bust through the front door, grab a quick snack, and then back out the door we would go. The objective? To see who could get to the four-wheeler first. <laughs> that way, you had driving privileges during evening chores. Now, about 90% of the time, this is the memory that can be referenced back to the numerous bruises we receive from shoving each other out of the way. Uh -huh. Or be the main cause of the near fist fights that were about to be unleashed in the middle of the barn. At such a young age, it never crossed my mind that one day, this memory would be where I call home. Or would define where I come from. Where do you come from? Where do you call home? Think about this quote. You've got to take advantage of an opportunity of a lifetime and a lifetime of opportunity. Back where I come from, when certain people enter your life, you take that opportunity to make them a lesson or a blessing. In 2001, a blessing entered my life when the man who I'm proud to call my father married my mom. Granted, he may not be my biological father, but this very protective, grizzly, Adams appearing man who scared off nearly half my days in high school, thanks, Dad, was always the first one to tell me when I've messed up, is and will forever be the person I call Daddy. I owe more than imaginable to him, for he and my mother blessed me with tremendous opportunity to become greater. Thanks to him and my mom, that's where I'll be when it's said and done. If it wasn't for him blessing me with his presence, I wouldn't have the memories that I do from growing up in England, or the opportunities I had as we moved to Douglas. Now, I know a majority of you in here have a Facebook, but show of hands, how many of your parents have a Facebook? <laughs> yeah, mine do too. I'm scrolling through my news feed one day, and I get a friend request from a Wade Butter, that's my dad. Thinking nothing of it, I hit the accept button. But as soon as I did, fear ran through me as I could only picture the embarrassment of having to help him poke his friends, show status updates, or have a comment back on the Working Ranch magazine page. But nonetheless, on August 22nd, 2013, the day I left the only place I know, back where I come from, I was pleasantly surprised to receive a notification of a post on my wall. Looking back on this small comment made on Facebook made me realize the impact that he had made on my life. Two parts of this post stood out to me. The first, go make a life of yourself and enjoy everything that comes your way. This made me think of 
every opportunity by which he provided for me. And then when it stated, don't ever forget where you come from and the values that you live by, they will take you far. I immediately referenced everyone who had touched my life and helped me get my of the day back where I come from. See, everybody in this building has opportunities. Everyone has had someone or numerous people grant you with these opportunities and has entered your life as a lesson or a blessing. Even more so, we all remember where we come from and we need not forget it. Who gave you opportunities? Who's helped you along the way? Where do you come from? I want you to take a second and to think about the individual importance of each one of those questions and where they hold a special place in your heart. Wyoming SFA, this is where I come from. These people right here in front of me are the people who help me get where I am today. I know I don't say it as often as I should, but I'd like to thank each and every one of you for the impact you've made on my life. Big or small, your actions have served a purpose and constantly reminded me of where I come from. So thank you for making me proud as anyone to say, that's where I come from. Wyoming SSA, what lies in front of us and what lies behind us are all tiny matters compared to what lies within us. Take time out of your day to thank the people who helped get you where you are today. But Wyoming SSA, more importantly, be proud as anyone to say, that's where you come from.